Hi, my YouTube family. How are we doing? Thought I'd come in and sit down and chit chat with y'all because there's something going on here now that's... <sighs> we have another situation going on in our world. I just made me some, a quick meal, some spaghetti. I'm gonna put some Parmesan cheese on it. And for dessert, I'm gonna have some ice cream and a Publix vanilla cupcake. So how's everybody day been? So, I don't know anything about this here what they call it, cyber gas, or, you know, the shortage of gas that's coming through. So hopefully someone could explain to me in the comments, it, has it ever happened before? Or is the first time that we're going through gas shortage? And I'm just, um, me and my daughter, I asked my daughter about it, and she just hoped that, that everybody doesn't panic and use up all the gas and then we don't, you know, we don't have anything, which is true. Mm. 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 That's hot. I might've made me a little bit too much pasta. I love spaghetti. See, this is why I can't do keto. I'm gonna try to do some keto meals. There's so much keto meals out there. I don't know, maybe. I don't know, because there are so many that you guys, I mean, keto's been out for a while. Mm. And all you basically have to do is, you know, you already know what you can't eat in keto. So I don't know, I'll, I'll, I'll figure it out if I decide to do one, you guys will be the first to know if I do decide it. I have me some toast here on the side that I love to eat it with some butter. So this gas problem Mm. Is this something to be concerned about? Because my sister-in-law called me and asked me, and I told her I had no idea. She said my brother called her and told her to make sure she fill up the vehicles because I think she said vehicles or he was gas cans or something. So can can someone explain to me about the um this short of gas? I mean, should we go ahead on and fill it up? Because we do have can canisters. My husband, y'all don't understand. <sighs> My husband hates going to the gas station. I mean, he will come all the way home and the truck is on E. And when he parked, the gas light comes on. That's how much he hate not going to the gas station. So we have canisters for that reason, but they might come in handy now for this shortage of gas. Mm. Mm. Is time gonna be that hard? Cause somebody on, uh, on my other social media account said if we do have a gas shortage to make sure that all the buses get filled because then if they don't we're going to be homeschooling again
That is so true. Mm. Wow, gas shortage. First we were no toilet paper, no bleach, no hand sanitizers. Now we're no gas. If there's not going to be any gas, we might as well shut down now. Gas is how we move around. That's how we go to work. That's how trucks deliver to the stores for us to get stuff to eat. Clothes lines, clothing line. So I really don't know what's gonna happen because I'm just trying to grasp my brain around it. I need someone to help me understand it. Cause this is something new to me. I'm drinking cran juice here. Cranberry, I'm sorry, juice. It is so crazy. It was slow in the office today. I kept getting, um, what kind of calls? Soliciting calls. And as soon as I announced the name of our firm, they hang up. I think I got like four or five today. This spaghetti is good. I love spaghetti. <laughs> My daughter. On the other hand, one can't eat it because of the red sauce. I don't know why my other daughter Josephine doesn't like spaghetti. I don't even know why she don't like it. I'm gonna have to ask her why she don't like it. Mm -mm -mm. So it, it rained hard over here yesterday. When I got home, it rained. Mm. I like it when I get home and it just starts to rain once you're home. I love this cheese. I eat a lot of this cheese. Maybe I should I should have, you know what I, sometimes I do with my spaghetti is that once I get it all ready, I'll just take some, um, um, oh, what kind of cheese is that? Um, provolone cheese or an American heart sharp cheddar and melt it in the sauce and then eat it. My daughter likes my daughter like that. And then I put a little bit of, oh, sometimes I make barbecue um, spaghetti. <laughs> I make my barbecue sauce. And then I make, um, it depends on if I feel like making the spaghetti sauce with the tomatoes and stuff. It's not hard to do, but sometimes I just go in and buy a jar of spaghetti sauce and dazz it up a little bit to get a more flavor. And um, I do my spaghetti like that. I put some two times spice in it sometimes. Mm -mm. I didn't used to eat hot stuff, but for some reason, I don't know. I couldn't stand hot stuff in my food. I feel like I got something inside of my mouth. I couldn't do hot spice. But now, 
give me some two times spice. Let me see. I made some, um, actually my, um, Frank skirk that I seasoned. I, I don't even know I put it up yet. That one was really spicy. It was good. I don't even know if I video cooked it because um, I think I got some company came. My husband came home. I don't, know how to look. I don't think so. But I, I did do the, um, I did put up the, the chuck roast beef steak that I did. I did put that up. I know that, but I don't, I put the, the, um, the marinade process for my Frank steak up and the marinade for the, don't quote me, but I need to make sure I put it up. I did a yellow rice. I really put too much of this on my plate. How many ready for a vacation? Mm. I need a vacation. My husband's working. Ooh, he just, I'm getting full. Oh my God, you too. Did I eat something for breakfast? Had I had an egg and toast for breakfast. Some orange juice and some fruit. Hmm. And I am like, I don't know. I'm full. Wow. I had two scrambled eggs. I had a bowl of fruit. I had um, two, a, one slice of raisin bread and an orange juice. Hmm. So why am I getting full from this? I don't know. Mm. I don't know. Mm. So who wants to see me do a seafood gumbo? I think my daughter's gonna go over spend it at her friend's house. And I'll probably do it then. A seafood gumbo. I have to do a small one because I me and my husband have to be able to eat it up before she comes home Sunday. So I have to make sure I do a small one. Oops. But when you do food like that, how are you supposed to do a small? Oh, I got small pots, but. By the time you add all the ingredients in there, it begins to be a lot. I haven't cooked it in a while for my daughter. I'm gonna have to call my uncle to make sure 
Because <laughs> he's he knows how to do it. He still make it. He he puts it up on his on his um Facebook page all the time. Hmm. This is quenching my palate here. <clears throat> Excuse me, my body must be didn't want food. So this probably would be my dinner. If my husbands don't eat, if my husbands, if my husband don't eat it. Mm -hmm. Oh, my daughter comes home hungry enough, she'll eat it. Mm. Good thing I did it because this ice cream is getting melted. Mm. It's good. I'm not going to get to that cupcake. Oh, did you hear that burp? Sorry if you did. I got halfway. I didn't even really touch this. This is weird. Maybe my body didn't really want spaghetti. Maybe I wanted the spaghetti, but my, yeah, sometimes you want something and, but your body be like, mm, no, not really. And the body wants what it wants, and that's not what it wanted. I think it just wanted some sweets, because it took that ice cream in with no problem. So back to what, what I was talking about, about this gas thing here. This is something that I need to be concerned about. I, I, should I forewarn my kids, my children, my friends, families? If they don't, because I don't look at news. I don't, I, sh let me tell y'all, news is so depressing that I just refuse to even look at it. Everything that comes on, even in commercials, I just don't do it. I try to do commercials sometimes, but I just want to look at the movie or I just want to look at the program without being interrupted. So, I'm like, mm -mm -mm. time for me to almost do my hair again, too. It's getting naps on the roots. So it's about time for me to redo my hair again, too. My hair goes pretty fast, so I have to be conscious. I think my daughter's going to try to help me this time. She was asking me um, what day I was going to do it, what time I was going to do it. So... Hopefully, she would help me do I just need help with the back because being able to get so long, I'm, I'm probably putting a, um, a little bit too much than I need to put because I only need to put it on the roots, maybe about this much, just on the root, not like this much because my hand grew that much. I just need to get it to the root of the hair. That's all I need to do. I can see the front and I can do that, but the back, I can't. I wish, you know have a stand-up double mirror, but then it's hard. You're still trying to see, well, is that the way it goes? That's the way it goes, but that's where it is. <sighs> Sorry. I... Did it again. You know how you go in that little days. Those, I mean, and then what makes it so bad is that when you go in the little days, you really don't be thinking about nothing. You just zone out. You don't be thinking about anything or anybody. You just, I guess your, your mind needs to shut down time. I think that's what it is. 
You hear my outside family? My garbage people. Oh, that's the recycle. They coming really late. They are really late because they used to be here. Yeah, I did notice it when I pulled in right the recycle thing was still outside. But they usually come around 5.30 in the morning. And the same thing with the garbage people. Sometimes you see them come 4 or 5 in the afternoon. I've been wondering, um, what's going on with that? And he's not even on my side. He's going the opposite way. He's gone the opposite way. He's not even on my side. Oh, I'm full, YouTube. I mean, I'm really is full. So one of my kids will eat this meal. So I just wanted to come in and try to chip. So I just wanted to come in with you guys and chit chat and while I try to do a quick meal, which at least I thought I was hungry, but turns out that I'm not really hungry. I just probably just wanted something sweet to eat because I did eat all that, but I didn't even touch the Publix cupcake. My daughter brought it home for her, but it's Publix cupcake and the icing looks really good. They did a good job with the icing on here. I can, I mean, they did. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yep. So, YouTube, I am going to end this video here by saying, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Hit that notification bell. Hit that like button so you guys will be notified the next time I put a video up. And don't forget to follow me on all my social media accounts down in my bio. So until then, you guys have a wonderful, blessed, and a safe day. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.